Hello everybody and welcome to Sutton's Days. We're going to do another wonton home can pantry challenge video. Are you ready for this one? So if you could remember in January I did uh, pecan pie in a jar, bourbon pecan pie in a jar. So good. Everyone loved it. It was amazing. So I had one jar left of that and I'm like well what can I do to use the rest of these wontons? Oh, yeah we are going to make some little mini pecan pies. Pecan pie bites. So before I turned on the camera, what I did is I took this jar because there's a lot of sugar in here and so it solidifies. So I took the jar and I ran super hot water and kind of warmed it up. Three eggs in the bowl, okay? And now we're going to work at getting this Okay, out. so what I did is I took a small pot of water and it's got to be the same temperature as the jar. And unfortunately, it got down to 41 last night here, so um, the jar was cold. So I started off with cold water and let it heat up. Okay. And then it makes it easier to get out of the jar. Believe it or not. Ooh, actually the bottom's pretty hot. Okay. So if you do the pecan pie in a jar, do it in a wide mouth jar. Definitely makes it easier to get out. I will remember that for next time because I will still put it on my shelf just because it's so good and so easy um, to keep around. But, okay. There we go. We're almost there. Anyway, so I did this in jar for Jarred of January. I'll link you to the video. Um, and honestly, it's very tasty. But it can be challenging to get it out of the jar unless you heat the jar up okay so I have three eggs I have the contents of the jar and I have the equivalent of my guesstimation of five tablespoons of butter 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 okay so we are going to get this all mixed together sorry if you can hear the dogs there's deer in the yard and the dogs are having a fit okay so we're gonna get this all mixed up together and when we do we'll be right back. So we've got them all mixed up now we're gonna take our spray and we're gonna make sure to really coat the inside of the muffin tin because we don't want the wonton wrappers sticking now in the meantime I'm heating up the oven because I forgot to do it to 375 there we go Okay. And now we are going to take our wonton wrappers and we are going to place them in the muffin tin just like we did for the pot pie. Okay, I have a feeling that's two, but who knows? Okay, so you're going to push them down in there to make little cups. These, I think this is just an excellent use of the pecan pie filling and the wonton wrappers. Simple, easy little crusts. Great little desserts that so many would love. We're gonna do this a little different than the pot pie though um, because I do want to make sure that the wonton wrappers are crunchier, you know? So we are going to get these all in the tin and then we're going to give them a quick spray quick quick spray of uh, the oil and put them in the oven to par cook you don't want them super crispy when you par cook them because they have to go back in the oven again you know so you don't want to burn everything but you do want those little cups browned up we have all of the the wrappers in. We're going to give it a light coating with the cooking spray, okay? And we're going to put them in the oven for probably, I'd say, about five okay, minutes. Okay, so we we'll bake these for about five minutes. I don't want them browned. You know, i just baking them up a little bit because they'll bake more in the oven with the pecan pie mixture. Okay, now we're going to fill them. I can see using these for uh, appetizers, 
uh, little desserts at work, little finger, you know, little finger foods at events. Um, this week was the first week since all of the COVID stuff started that we had our family dinner on Sunday, actually on Saturday. So that was nice. And out of all of this, our daughter-in-law gained new employment where she no longer has to work on Sundays. So that is going to be very nice moving forward. Okay, so we're just scooping in. Now because of the sugar content, <laughs> okay, um, really try not to get it on the outside of the cup. Stuff happens, so you know, you may get it on the outside of the cup, but um, it will stick. Seriously. It's still hot. I think these are going to be incredible. And I know one of my co-workers wants some. Whoops. Remember that whole thing about not getting it on the outside? Okay. There we go. It's okay. I was doing good for a little bit there. Okay. So we are going to put these in the oven for about 20 minutes and then we're going to see how they're doing and we'll fake it from there. I'm going to have to make a few extras. Shucks. It's okay. Most of these are being rehomed like almost immediately. Okay. But they are cups and you know pecan pies don't have tops on them typically so I think this will work out beautifully. Kind of having fun with this whole wonton thing, you guys. I didn't realize how much fun they could be. Okay, so we're going to take these now and put them in the oven. 375 is what I preheated the oven for, for 20 minutes, 25 minutes. Watch them, keep an eye on them, but I'll let you know how long we actually end up the timer has not gone off yet. I have like one minute left. I'm going to cancel it because I peeked in. And I do believe we are good. Look at those. Look at those. Okay. <clears throat> We're going to give them a couple minutes to cool down. And then these we'll have cooled off for literally just a minute or two. So they're still going to be a little pliable, which is. Look at how easy that came out. Hello. Okay. See, we don't want to burn the wontons, but we do need them to be crisp. Oh my gosh, you guys, these are spectacular. They just come right out with no problems at all. <laughs> Can you see how beautiful these are? Okay. Yes. Okay. So now we really are going to let them sit and completely cool before I try to get anybody to do a taste test besides everyone is outside right now doing yard work so oh my gosh these just look amazing okay Phil's gonna give us his opinion you want to hold the plate Bye. Yeah. Give me, yeah, give me okay, that. so those are our petite pecan pie in wonton wrappers. <laughs> They're an awesome treat. They passed the fill taste test. I hope everyone has an opportunity to give these a try. Remember to check out the video for pecan pie in a jar. And until next time, remember, be safe.